Hey guys, in this tutorial I'm going to show you how to escape single and double quotes in JavaScript. So let's say I have um, some string message hello, um, hello there. And as you may know, if you use double quotes inside double quotes, um, you're going to generate an error. So let's try that out. It's the same for single quotes, but here I'm just going to use double quotes uh, as an example. Um, so, as you can see, unexpected identifier. You cannot use double quotes inside double quotes unless you escape them with a forward slash. So let's print that message out and you'll see that we'll have double quotes in the result. It's perfectly fine if you use single quotes inside double quotes or double quotes inside single quotes, so there's no error there. It's totally fine, but what you probably actually want to use is the template literal format. It's this special third quote that is located next to your one key. It's called the backtick quote and it's used to create something that in JavaScript is called template literals. The backtick quote can also be escaped with a forward slash just like any other quote. So I would just use the backtick quote because it allows you to use both uh, single and double quotes and you don't even have to escape them. And so one of the other useful things you can do with the backtick quotes is, again, it's treated as a template literal in JavaScript, and that means you can embed variables dynamically into the string. For example, here's there are 10 apples, and the apple, uh, the number of apples can be represented by a variable. And so with a template literal, you can use the dollar sign in the brackets to embed that uh, statement or a value into your string. Now if you change that back to uh, regular double quotes it's simply not going to work. You'll, you'll simply get the literal value of whatever you're typing, but the backtick converts those to statements or variables. You can use functions there or variable names or any other valid JavaScript statement and you still get the double quotes and single quotes without having to escape them. So use the backtick, it's the best quote ever. 